Hello party people, it is Will Pemble, and today we are gonna be playing with, working with, experimenting with, doing dangerous things with these two super strong neodymium magnets. But before we get started, if you could do me a favor, please click the like button, click the subscribe button, and ring the bell so that you can stay up to date with what's going on in this crazy project, and you can help the channel move forward. I really appreciate it. Anyway, let's get going with this. What we have here are two pieces of neodymium. These are two inch diameter round by one inch thick neodymium magnets. As you can see, they're stuck together. Um, they are, they are so stuck together that, you know, I'm not the strongest guy in the world, but I do okay. And I cannot get these two things to unstick. These are bone crushing magnets. What we're gonna use these magnets for is we're gonna use these magnets as part of a push system that's gonna use electromagnetism and uh, magic physics, electronic science to launch our cart. If you go back a couple of episodes, what you'll see is we had this idea where we wanna get the cart to go from zero miles an hour to 21 miles an hour in 0.8 seconds. These two magnets, and maybe more magnets like these, these N50 neodymium magnets, these figure into that. What I wanted to do today was show you just how crazy powerful these magnets are. So I've got a little experiment set up here. What we're gonna do is we're gonna peel these magnets apart using a little doohickey that I put together. We're gonna pry these two magnets apart, and then we're gonna slide them really close together so that at some point, usually about six or so inches apart, they're gonna go boom, just like that. And they smash together with incredible force. And I'm gonna put some things in between the two magnets to give you an idea of just how fast they smash together and just how much force they smash together with. And so we're gonna crush a soda can, we're gonna smash a pencil, we're even gonna smash, I found um, a buffalo wing chicken bone, which I think is about the same as a finger to give you an idea of just what would happen if you were to get your finger in between a couple of these crazy strong neodymium magnets. Um, I work with dangerous stuff out in the garage all the time, things where, you could, where things can go wrong really fast. I've never worked with anything as seemingly friendly and incredibly instantaneously dangerous as these magnets. Uh, so anyway, we're gonna do some experiments I'm gonna go ahead and say don't try these at home because golly, they're crazy, crazy potential for instant irreparable harm. You get your finger stuck between a couple of these neodymium magnets and your finger's not coming back from that. You're gonna smash your finger. That's why I'm wearing these welding gloves is if there is like a little pinch or something like that, I can slide my hand out of the glove and, and maybe save myself uh, from losing a finger or a body part. So these are definitely bone crushing magnets. And just to illustrate that again, we're actually gonna crush a bone. That's what this video is. The next thing we're gonna do with these magnets in the next video, so absolutely remember, click the like button, click the subscribe button, click the bell, so that the next video you'll know because we're gonna take this and we're gonna build this into an electromagnetic launch system, a coil gun, uh, sort of a launch system. It's gonna be really, really cool. So, with uh, no further ado, let's get started smashing some things with the magnets. Okay, here's our Coca-Cola test. Dang. That's insane.
So here's what our magnet carnage looks like at the end of our experiment. We've smashed a couple of things with very little effort using just the force that the magnets put on each other. Here's our two inch round by one inch thick N50 neodymium magnet. It made incredibly short work of our aluminum can. We had to chop the can up in order to pry the magnets apart. It smashed our number two pencil quite handily, as you may recall. And then the thing that was scariest to me is this is what's left of our chicken bones, which to me seem about the same thickness as maybe a human finger or a human hand bone. Maybe they're th even thicker than that. But what we've learned is that when these two magnets get within about six inches of each other, and if you look at this hole here and that hole there, those are about six inches apart. When they get about six inches apart from one another, they snap together at an incredibly fast speed. The next piece of the experiment for us is gonna be how we can use this incredible strength, these amazing magnets, and combine them with electromagnets, and we'll make some of those. How can we use this incredible power to push our coaster, to launch the coaster? And that's what I wanted to show you in this video is just how insanely energetic these things are and they just sit there with all that power all the time. Electromagnetic fields are absolutely amazing. The next step in the electromagnetism experiment is gonna to be to take that power and harness it to push our coaster down the track. So that'll be the next bit of it. Thank you for helping me bring physics, family, and fun to kids everywhere. I am Will Pemble and I'll see you soon.